guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is day two of my um challenge to myself and it went well today. I went back to the gym and I met with the um trainer who's going to be training me in the next little bit. Um yeah, and it went really well. I think uh we connected well and we seemed to kind of jive well, which was great. Um, his name is Sean, and uh, it was really cool actually because he's never worked with someone with a disability before. So for me, it was really interesting because it kind of, you know, showed me that he was up for the challenge and um, he wanted the experience. So the majority of clients that he has, he told me, were um, or are people with different types of injuries, so it could be like the knees or back, things like that, but he's never, like I said, never worked with someone with a disability um, previous to me, so kind of cool, <laughs> and um, we, it's going to be neat for me because I'll probably be bringing in a bit of my previous experience with my, with the other trainer that I used to have, um, you know, in terms of what I do uh, in the gym and that sort of thing. So, but it'll be neat to see how we work together. Um, and also, I think it's a cool thing because it kind of, it sort of made me feel like he, which is a good thing, is very confident in, you know, what he has to offer. And um confident in just the fact that he thought he uh had the knowledge to be able to help me and um it really felt like he had my best interests at heart and um you know really wanted me to get out of this whatever I could and, and you know anything that I could. So that was really cool to see because I've had some experience, not myself personally, but um, I've heard from people that I've known uh, who've had experiences that, you know, they meet up with someone who um, is supposed to train them, whether it be in the gym or some other type of sport, let's say, too, um, where they just don't seem to have your best interest at heart. They just don't really seem invested in this. I mean, for me, it's as much as it is for me, it's for him too, because like I said, with him not, not, you know, having worked with someone with a disability prior to me, it's going to be a new experience for him. So, you know, it's, while I'm investing my time and my money into him, he's also investing the time, um, to, you know, do research about my disability, which I was really, um, you know, impressed with last night. He said he went home uh, after meeting me yesterday and did some research about my disability and, um, you know, what types of exercises and things that we could work on together, which I thought was really cool because, again, sometimes you, I think you meet people who couldn't really care less and, um, you know, in a gym setting, you know, or even just a job setting in general, if your job is to help someone with a disability in whatever way, if you're not invested in it and you're not, you know, willing to try in whatever way you can, you're not really in the right job. <laughs> um, you know, it's it's it takes heart, it takes um, courage to want to step out into, you know, something that you've never done before. And I give him kudos for doing that because, um, not to say that it's like such a difficult thing to do, but when you don't have experience with someone like myself who has a disability, I mean, it's a big deal. So, um, I give him, you know, kudos for, uh, for stepping out and wanting to do this with me. So I'm excited and I'm excited to see what comes and, uh, how this works out. Um, so, that said, I'm going to try to keep these videos as um, consistent as I can. I am going home for the weekend. Um, 
I'm going to try to do videos tomorrow morning before I leave, but I won't be here on Saturday. So, um, and I mean, sometimes too, like, I won't be going to the gym every day, obviously, so, you know, there may not be anything to video. <laughs> um, but I mean, I may just get on here and, and talk about, you know, how I'm feeling and that sort of thing. Um, as well, if, if you guys are interested in that sort of thing as well, so, um, but it may not be as consistent as I had hoped, um, meaning I may not be doing it on the daily, but, um, I will try to keep it as consistent as I can, so, today's day two, and, um, we'll see what happens, I'm looking forward to, uh, to working with Sean and seeing how this goes, um, seeing how my progress unfolds. So, stay tuned. <laughs> I hope you guys have a great weekend, and I will see you hopefully tomorrow. <laughs> Bye, guys.